asking who are you, what do you want? Mike realized that Sarah couldn't see anything, so he got even more aggressive. He kept throwing things on the floor to provoke Sarah. As a book fell hard on the floor, Sarah panicked and ran into the room. After locking the door behind her, she took out her laptop and prepared to call the police. At this point, Mike crashed through the glass and came into the room. He pounced on Sarah in one fell swoop. He got on top of Sarah and took control of her hands with one hand. With one hand he put a knife to her neck. Then Sarah was tied to a steel pipe on the bed. Wait, do foreigners have steel pipes on their beds? If you know what you're doing, enlighten me. Mike was kind enough to wipe the blood from Sarah's thighs. Looking at her long and beautiful legs, Mike was tempted to do something bad. To show his kindness, he untied Sarah's hands. Mike told Sarah that his boyfriend had taken his money. He came over to get the money back. Sarah said she didn't know where the money was. Mike